Hey everyone, it's Ethan here from EV Studios and Studio 710. I want to do a review of the 16-35mm Canon L lens and a video about how to do DSLR video with the EOS 60D. So I definitely recommend this lens to any videographer and photographer. It is f2.8, so you definitely get a lot of bokeh, and it's great for DSLR video because it's super wide, and it's not zoomed in, so if you're in a small room, you can get the full shot, and if you want to zoom, you can just walk towards it. And the zoom to 35 is not very large, um, but it works um, for some situations. As you can see in this footage, it can cut, it has this uh, focus monitor thing, so the person that's racking focus on the film set can figure out, oh, the actor's three feet away, let me turn it to three feet. Um, it also has a closest focusing distance of 0.92 feet, um, so it's not a macro lens. It also has, in this footage you can see, it has this um, kind of bulby front element, so it's good to put one of these cheap um, UV filters on here um, to protect the lens. Besides that, the only thing I don't like about this lens is it doesn't have any image stabilization. Another plus about this lens, besides it being metal, is all of these zooming is happens inside of the body of the lens, so there's, there's no extruding element. Besides that, it's a great lens and it works with any um, uh, EF mount DSLR, and it's not EFS, so it doesn't, it, it, um, it can work on those full frame DSLRs. So um, let's go to the video about the um, DSLR video with the EOS 60D. Let's go outside. Okay, so now we're going to jump into the portion of this video where we talk about our DSLR workflow slash how to do DSLR video with the EOS 60D. So the first step is to press the Q button and choose your white balance setting. Um, I'm going to go with, um, so you have auto, daylight, shade, cloudy, tungsten, color white fluorescent, flash, custom, and color temperature. If you have a light meter, you can put in the Kelvin. Um, so we're going to go shade. Yeah, shade looks the most rich right now, even though it's not actually shady. So I'm going to press the Q button again to get out of that menu. First thing I'm going to do is, with that bat white balance, I'm going to focus on the subject. Right now, I'm again with the 1635mm L lens on the EOS 60D. I'm zoomed into 35mm, and let me focus. I'm at f2.8, so a nice amount of bokeh. I just took a test picture, which we'll be showing now. Um, the next thing I'm going to do is, my so I, I want my aperture to be at 2.8, so I get that large amount of bokeh. Now also make it a little bit overexposed, so then I have to compensate by changing the shutter speed. So I'm going to bring the shutter speed to 60 or 80. I'm going to go with 80. So one, I think it's, I believe it's 1 80th of a second. And I believe, um, so we have our, oh and then we have to set our ISO. So the sweet spot right now I'm going to go for ISO. Oh, and then for each DSLR there's a number where it begins to green. In this case, on this 60D, it's a thing, I believe it's 1,600. So I'm going to go with ISO 160. Let's focus one more time, just to make sure. So now we're at ISO 160. Shutter speed is 1 80th of a second. Um, we're at uh, white balance shade and f2.8. So let's take some video. And I'll be showing right now. You might hear my dog in the background. And that red light on the side of the camera right here goes uh, when it's recording, so it's saving to the SD card slot right here. And you can also see all these settings, your aperture and all that stuff on the top of the DSLR on this touch on this uh, screen here if you have the 60D. But many of the other Canon DSLRs don't. So let's take that off. So let's try a new subject. This time we're going to move this table and this lens out of the way. Let me grab my dog. Stay. Alright, so we're going to move my camera to her. Zoom to 35, focus. We still have this great ISO setting. Uh, it's a little bit overexposed now, so we're going to bring my shutter speed down to 1 200th of a second. Actually, let's do 1 2 3 20th of a second and have Ella look over here. And there it, those pictures are going. So now we're going to start playing the video. The video is recording. You can see my dog. Going. And it also has, um, one thing that's good about the video on the 60D is it has these manual audio controls. Oh, she's out of the way. And that's my dog. So, um, if you have any questions about DSLR video with any of the Canon DSLRs, including the T2i, which we're filming this on, or about the 60D, or about the 16-35L lens, um, 
I will be glad to answer them if you leave it in the comments be comments below. And um, again, subscribe to my second channel if you're interested in more DSLR stuff like this. Thanks for watching. See ya.